Hey guys, how's it going? Um, happy, oh, happy, it's Tuesday. It feels like Wednesday, but it's uh, Tuesday. I don't know why it feels like Wednesday, because for some reason, um, sorry, I'm just, I'm gonna be lifting later. So, this is what cracks me up. I told you guys when I first started taking these, I was reading the directions and it says, um, as a dietary supplement, mix one scoop with six ounces of water or your favorite sports drink. On workout days, consume pre-workout, during workout, or post-workout. Okay, why don't you just tell me which one? Why don't they just say, consume this on your workout days? Anyway, um, take on it. I didn't get a cover out, but this uh, mixes up really well, or maybe it won't. Maybe I'll need a spoon. I don't have my... Um, my cover here for this because my dishwasher is running. Right now there's actually a whole lot going on in my house in the background. I have Christmas music playing. Don't judge me. I realize it's past Halloween. That's when the Christmas music comes out. So cheers to you. Happy election day. I thought I got it all over myself. Anyway, I can't be as lengthy as I usually am. I know you're bummed. And boy, do I need to get my nails done. Sometimes, oh. <laughs> okay, first of all, my nails are in terrible need I, and I'm not able to get them done until Thursday, I think. When am I going, Thursday? I don't know. But anyway, remember when I told you I worked out with an exorcist? With my gloves, mind you. And I wailed on that thing. And I am still, I don't know if you can tell, I'm still recovering. See all of these sores? Like it still is hurting me. Did you see when I'm, like when I use a towel to wipe my hands, I'm gonna have to write to them and ask how I, because I really like that thing, but I'm kind of figuring like how, if I'm wearing gloves and they, I messed up my knuckles that much, I've got to find a way to wrap and maybe put body glide on or something so that I protect, you know, Mr. Flow. There you go. Flow. And as you can tell, maybe you can tell, I've gone tanning just a little bit. It's getting deathly pasty white. But <laughs> I have to share something with you guys. <gasps> Sometimes it scares me how nerdily excited I get about fitness, either equipment or um, events or um, clothes. What I do. I'm starting to turn into a completely different person as far as fashion is concerned because I'm finding myself having more workout clothes, hats, um, tennis shoes. I call them tennis shoes. I don't know why because clearly I don't play tennis. And workout clothes. So actually when I go to get dressed to like go out, I have two things. I have workout clothes and then I have my business clothes, which I rarely wear anymore, even when I go on meetings. Um, Everybody tends to be in workout clothes and jeans, so, and I'm also at this annoying place with my jeans, because I have a couple of pair of jeans. This is a good thing, but it's kind of an annoying thing. A couple of pairs of jeans I bought when I first gained weight a year or so ago. No, probably a couple years ago. I don't know when I bought them. It's been a while. Those are falling off of me, so that's a good thing, right? The jeans, when I had to go up a size, they're falling off of me. In fact, I feel like those. Remember when people first started wearing um, jeans. Okay, I'm gonna sound old right now, but like I remember when Britney Spears first started wearing jeans, and I'm like, girl, pull those jeans up. Like, there gets a point, people. I, I don't understand this about fitness pictures either. What's with like every picture of every guy and every girl? They have to be holding their pants like, I'm about to pull my pants down. It's like they're four, remember when you're like four or five and kids would say to each other, like, I'll show you mine if you show me yours. Like, that's what fitness is. It's like, oh, hi, it's not enough that I'm just wearing this bikini that's hardly covering everything. Now I'm gonna pull it down. I mean, it's like, what's the point? I don't need to see that much information down there, if you know what I'm saying. I don't care if you're a girl or a guy. It's like, oh, really, really? Pull your pants up. Men, women, I don't care who you are. And I also don't care how old I sound. I'm old. Um, but my jeans that are too big, like I was wearing them on a flight and they're so big around the uh, hips and stuff, which again, I'm glad about, but they were falling down and I'm like, oh dear God, it's a good thing I have a long tank top on. So I can't wear those, but then my size eight Levi's, which I love, 
Um, they fit, but they're just still a little too tight for comfort. I don't, I don't like my jeans to be tight, tight when I wear them. I like to have a little breathing room. So um, I've got just a few minutes and I have to show you this. So all that said, I need to, part of me wants to go jean shopping, part of me wants to say suck it up and wear workout clothes for a while. And maybe a month from now I'll be very, very happy with how my, um, my Levi's are fitting me. Because I love my Levi's. I'm just, I haven't found yet a cool pair of jeans um, outside of Levi's that I really like. I'm sure I will. Don't worry. But look what came from my UPS friend today. I'm not lying to you. I think these might be the most epic just looking shoes that I like and I'm going to want this in every conceivable bright color like this. Are you ready? Pizzow! Oh my god. Like I'm so in love with these. These are Reeboks. Seriously? Can you guys grasp how bright these are? And I'm not, I, clearly I look better when I have more of a tan. These, okay, first of all, you know, if I'm just gonna wear shoes around, I, that's just me. I always like things that have more of a, a heel on it, and, and I also like support. You will never see me wearing minimalist shoes. It doesn't mean they're right or wrong. I'm just telling you what I tend to like. So whenever any kind of shoe, running shoe or otherwise, has um, a really nice bottom, it's the whole, like, I love high heels thing in me. It has nothing to do with fitness. I really like this. Um, I also like the feeling of stability in my shoe. I don't care if I'm wearing a running shoe or just a, a shoe for when I go uh, lift and, and train. I always, 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 the past several years, would only look for black shoes because, you know, it was the whole like black pants, black shoes, create one line and then nobody thinks you look fat. I'm kind of over that now. <laughs> Plus I feel better. I've lost weight, so there's that. Um, now I'm all about bright shoes. I'm all about bright shoes and bright colors. I am in love with this shoe. I gotta watch the time. So can you see the, the fabric? See, this is like cloth. This is leather, but this is like a soft, really soft mesh. Um, I, what model is this? So there's two models by Reebok that I like, and I believe, I better shut up. I don't know what I'm allowed to say and not say about it next year. Cool stuff from Reebok next year. Um, and also, full disclosure, I think most of you know, but let's just be safe, um, Reebok is a client of my company, Fitfluential. Um, this is Real Flex, Reebok Real Flex. They also have the other ones that I really like are the Zigs, that on the bottom has like a Zig, um, again, because they're big. I'm, I am absolutely, I'm gonna have to see what other colors they have in this. This is so bright and so gorgeous. I'm sorry. I honestly think these could be my favorite, favorite, favorite shoes, period, just as far as looks. Um, and then I'm gonna have to find out. I think this is more like um, training. I tend to wear my Reeboks right now for training and then for running, um, I have other shoes that I alternate, which I'll do reviews of those separately. But then they also sent out, this is part of the um, campaign that we're doing with them. So this is, was I not just saying that I need a long sleeve tops? Um, here I am in the middle of winter wearing tank tops. Um, this is a long sleeve, zips up the front. It also has the, I've got to watch the time. Um, ooh, look, keyhole. And yes, I have Christmas music on. I know I'm going to catch a lot of crap for that. Um, here's the inside. Ooh, look at the nice. This is so cute. I'm going to just try it on. Um, nice and soft. So you have the, like, ooh, this is really soft. Um, I don't know what the deal is with this inside, but this is also the, where's this sticker? Um, it's all about wicking. I can't talk to it right now. As if you can really read that. Let's just do this. Oh, shit. That's okay. I didn't rip it. I just ripped the tag out. This is the uh, Reebok Flex Collection. Um, a lot of you guys have been writing me. All, if you really want to find all of the stuff that I've ever shown you and you want to buy Reebok, yes, they're available at retail stores, but specifically everything is available if you go to shop.reebok.com. Um, and then you can look things up under women, under men, under clothing, under shoes, etc. Um, so this is 
Fitted, slim, regular, relaxed. Wow, that's kind of a lot to describe one shirt. It's also, this is what I wanted to show you, play dry. Um, moisture management system. Uh, I gotta go, I gotta call. Um, but anyway, I just had to show you the epic shoes, about which I am so excited. And I will take a picture of myself later wearing it. Um, because I know you are gonna ask them. I will uh, be back tomorrow, but you guys have a, did I even talk about anything for 10 minutes here? Um, I will see you guys tomorrow, and um, I'll tell you about my new uh, workout program that we're phasing into. See you tomorrow.